All right, so we're back over here on some Vanguard today. I actually, last night, I stayed up all night. The grind is finally done for, you know, the overall atomic camo. Why is my mouse still stay on the screen? There we go. As you can see, I've got atomic unlocked. That, uh, this final challenge, this dead eye challenge right here, destroy three enemy streak or kill streaks in one game 30 times, has got to be the most annoying challenge of all time. There's, there's no way there's something worse than this. Keep in mind, this is the first time I've ever done, you know, a mastery camo challenge. But, uh, moving into, uh, you know, today's video, we're using the well gun. And from what I've used, you know, so far, the well gun is actually really, really good. This thing, especially if you know, I think that once we toss on, something like uh you know the 48 round magazine we toss on something like uh incendiary rounds and then uh maybe there's uh there's no vital once we can actually use this in war zone i think that this gun is be good it's, it's gonna be meta especially on rebirth island this gun just works i don't know i don't know what it is it's just it just it's good somebody tweeted something yesterday it was an article and in it they discussed the well gun and apparently it's like a combination between like the sten and then some other gun or something like that i think it's a combination between the sten and the owen gun so as per usual my teammates they have dogs but my enemies you know they're not gonna get dogs it's just it's just not gonna happen i even was running care package last night i would just throw the care package somewhere in the map in hopes that the enemies would pick them up and they would be dogs i honestly think the saddest thing about that is just the fact that the amount for the amount of times i threw the care packages i literally got more kills from the care packages falling on random enemies than they actually did picking them up and getting dogs it's like it's kind of crazy kind of funny at the same time if you think about it you know a random care package falls from the sky and you, sh you know you get crushed but yeah that was my night i was just spent the entire time just throwing care packages hoping that they would you know have a kid dog you know dogs or guard dog anything like that because shooting uavs out shooting counter uavs out of the 30 i was able to shoot down one counter uav for the uavs in general i hit marker two it was very very discouraging i literally made them you know smoking and then i would shoot them and it still hit markered and then the other times where you know it'd be on the third thing to, to you know destroy and i would end up just destroying the uav on accident because i shot it like one too many times very very frustrating very very frustrating but obviously you know i got through it because here we are we're right here and uh you know we're onto the well gun which is like i said i think this gun is going to be really really good and honestly i'm probably going to time lapse this gun because uh, you know the big part about these weapons is literally just leveling them up and uh, i don't even think that this gun is level 20 for me yet so this is going to be we're, we're going to be here for a while it shouldn't honestly be that bad to my knowledge the camo challenges for like the 60 65 and 70 are actually bugged and they're actually really really easy to do the one other thing i noticed last night and it's just because of the last challenges that i did on the game running around with like melees and whatnot the lobbies were so insanely easy so hopefully these first few matches with the well gun me leveling this gun up they'll be extremely easy i'll just put a fly through these levels i do need to activate double xp unfortunately right now you still can't you know use the gun in warzone which honestly they did that on purpose vanguard sales are extremely low how do you get more people playing vanguard well you put the new guns in vanguard first and then warzone that's how you get people into it because being realistic if i was playing warzone right now i probably would have already gotten this gun leveled up from rebirth just doing the contracts you get so much xp it's insane especially when you pop devil xp just doing those supply runs over and over and over it's it's crazy no dude elijah why are you pre-firing me my teammate is literally sitting right in front of your face and you're pre-firing me like well, you literally could have taken a photo with him that that dude that is literally cod timing right there i ads'd and then i un ads to sprint and he's right there i just need a bigger magazine i need a bigger magazine 64 rounds with this gun doing you know 33 damage and vital being 49 that's crazy they literally put it in their blog post as well they were like this gun with the right attachments can two to three shot like it, that's that's crazy two to three shot you either pick the faster firing or you pick the uh the slower magazine and you get insane insane damage i'm just excited to use this in warzone to be honest with you and you know have atomic camo like this is the first time i went for a mastery camo in a game and i gotta say like i i i'm glad that i did it i don't know if it was necessarily worth it for the most part but i mean it got me playing the game you know what i'm saying it got me playing the game it got me you know my money's worth has been paid off you know what i'm saying i've already got over five days of in-game playtime on this over fifty thousand kills already and 
I literally stopped playing the game for a while. Basically, all of December, I didn't even touch this game. I really like how I'm able to spawn trap on this map still. It's really nice. Shipment is in shambles, but this map, this map's nice. Remote, 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 remote. Okay. Ooh, hello. <laughs> yep, level 23 magazine, 64 round magazine. I'm surprised it doesn't decrease the damage, especially that vital damage. That is a very, very, very strong, especially if I could toss off something like a incendiary with that. It's, it's going to be insane. Oh my God gosh 45 67 vital damage holy crap that doesn't even decrease the you know the the fire rate a ton that just increases the recoil but we could probably compensate for the recoil somewhere if we toss on uh maybe a stock or an under barrel that'll help a ton maybe maybe not i don't know maybe a barrel will do it barrel will definitely do it right there that's what'll do it that's what'll do it that's that's gonna be the meta barrel right there like why why is the match trying to start there is no one wants to play team deathmatch dude it just feels so good looking at these launchers knowing that i'm never going to have to touch these again and all the camo challenges are done like i during the grind i knocked out the bazooka and the panzer shrek mark 11 wasn't bad this panzer faust though dude even like the, the 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 fact that like it took so long for them to actually you know fix this challenge but not even general just fix the challenge but like the the, the aerial streaks are literally impossible to shoot down it's too hard it is too hard okay i'm not playing team deathmatch don't put me in team deathmatch dude like i'm not playing team deathmatch i'm not playing team deathmatch i'm not doing it I'm, I'm, I'm not doing it i would rather go on to blitz domination in like the regular game mode than play team deathmatch i just i'm not gonna do it especially once i pop double xp and i just go 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 not doing it no tdm dude i hate when my teammates actually play the objective and domination it genuinely sucks like i understand that's the you know whole premise and concept of it you know domination capture the flags but like oh my gosh it, it makes these lobbies a lot less predictable, you know? So we're a few hours in now and I finally have hit level 60 and because I can't actually, you know, see the challenges, I've done everything except for the long shots. I always do long shots last because I do them like hardcore or something like that. Uh, there's, I, I don't know what it is, but uh, I'm guess I'm getting camo tracking kills for this. I haven't done anything. I'm just, you know, playing the game and uh i guess something's counting i have no idea how does this happen though you know like uh, i there's no challenges that are displaying and i'm finally i'm getting tracking for this one the chance of me having the three red attachments on is very 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 small so hope i, I don't know maybe all of them are bugged and uh this will be just like the easiest uh you know final challenges ever Oh, I literally just might not even stay on this match. Shipment is just such a such a horrible space to be. Look at that. I got Fern right there. I have no idea what the challenge was, but it's counting. So I guess, you know, I'll keep doing whatever I'm doing and hopefully it works. Fa! The spawns were not like this in COD 4. The spawns were not like this when it was remastered for World War II. The spawns were like this for Modern Warfare because the game is horrible. You were stuck inside. You had nothing else to play. It wasn't good. Did it innovate? Absolutely. The graphics, the engine, amazing. Horrible maps, insanely fast time to kill. The spawns were horrible. You had safe spaces. Dead Silence was a field upgrade. Ghost was insanely overpowered. You had stopping power rounds on top of, you know, the like 0.2 millisecond time to kill or 0.2 or whatever. I don't know, whatever. It does, it's insanely fast. You literally die like, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. What is happening right here? This time to kill? It's even faster in Modern Warfare. How is that possible? I don't know. I just spawned in and I was dead. I was literally in the... I spent more time watching the kill cam than actually being alive. Like, you cannot tell me that this is balanced. Right now, just a quick update a few hours later now. I went and I took a nap and uh, I'm feeling a lot better now. Unfortunately, there's going to be another midnight up today. Or up midnight. Mid, 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 mid. There's going to be another midnight update tonight. So last night's was at 7 p.m., which was so nice. I don't think they're going to do the same thing tonight. I think it's going to, you know, the Warzone update's going to come out at midnight. But the only thing I got left is uh, the final challenge. And then I have a long shots. 
so i might as well just you know knock him out at the same exact time so i'll just hop into a you know a hardcore domination or something like that and uh, hope for something like demi ansk or something where i could just sit back and just farm kills hopefully it goes well um honestly this gun the well gun is probably going to be meta with the right builds and attachments because uh this gun right here especially like we're using like the shrouded barrel the recoil i don't think it's gonna be much of an issue this damage is absolutely insane and uh the fire rate isn't abysmal you got pretty good movement as well there's a lot of upsides to this gun i still petition that you know instead of the actually being you know called long shots in this game they call it social distancing i think that'd be pretty pretty you know funny especially with uh you know what's going on around the world i don't think anybody is going to misinterpret you know what it actually means you know it's like an inside joke but everybody's on the inside you know what i'm saying i don't know, i think that'd be pretty funny there we go baby there's the atomic i was waiting for it that's what i'm talking about there's atomic on the new well gun let's just let's just let's back out there's no reason to stay those long shots just farming on demiansk domination hardcore is so so good so we get the final three challenges done as of right now uh i don't know if it's if it's specific kills for the most part i think that it was tracking all kills so i would take advantage of that you know while you can before they go and actually implement some actual challenges and then of course save your long shots till the end because that's what dead eye is and uh you know once you get to the end just knock out you know level 70 knock out the, the 100 kills and knock out the 100 headshots at the same time that's pretty much all you can really do to you know make this a little bit more efficient let's uh let's hop over into a custom match though all right that i could be wrong about this i don't know what the button is on controller but in the weapon menu, uh, all your keybinds, you can actually press I and it says inspect and it actually does nothing. Okay, that's nice. Yeah, so I mean, that's pretty much it then for the video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a great rest of your day.